Hello again. I've been running a little less than usual as I've got some knee niggles. I fell over on trails twice recently and uh, my knees have been a bit sore as a result. So this morning I'm heading to a nearby village for just a gentle five miles across local fields. Nothing special. I'm just hoping to uh, ease the joints in a little bit. I'm heading for Great Tay, where I've started quite a few runs in the past. Right, arriving in the village, it's great to see the Ukrainian flag flying from the local church. Great deal of support for Ukraine in this country. Well, we'll just park up and make our way back to the church to start the run. Good morning, out at Great Tay this morning. Um, I'm just going to do a little four or five mile jog at the most, I would think. Uh, not a bad morning, it's uh, not quite as sunny as it has been, it's uh, a little bit cooler. So uh, all I really want to do today is just sort of try to ease in the old joints a bit. into the glory of the Great Tay Sewage Works. When we go into this section, I normally turn the hat round. Lots of uh, low branches. And of course, if you're wearing a peak cap, you just run straight into them. So, uh, excuse the look, but uh, it has a purpose. Right, quick stop to put the hat on straight again and uh, I'm standing at the moment over the Roman River and you can probably hear the sewage outlet trickling in from uh, the Great Tay Sewage Works. quite know this time of year whether you're going to find your favourite footpath all ploughed up but uh, so far that not too bad. I often go around the side here so I did stop and check that this is actually a footpath. say that navigation is the first thing to go but uh, I just ran, ran down that way 90 degrees to where I wanted to go wrong side of the hedge to begin with never mind we're back on track now <laughs> I think I've never done this before there you go I can't see the footpaths quite clearly now here onto this little bridleway. Oh, 
like this route is not too bad through here. Sometimes it really is very overgrown. Right, so I decided to do a right here uh, and then go out to a house called Braziers and uh, then cut down across over the Roman River. Right, so we've just done a loop that we didn't need to, but I might have gone across another footpath there. Let's take this footpath down towards the Roman River. Ah, quite a nice little lake here. It's fed by the Roman River, comes in in that direction. We'll jog up here just for a little way and then pick up the footpath across Abraham's farm, uh, which will take us back towards Great Tay. Well, we do a right round here and cross over Abraham's farm. many nettles today. Uh, normally I'd continue on here to Brick Hill Cottage and then back past the sewage works but uh, I noticed that there's another footpath here so I'm going to go up this Park. 5.27 miles on the watch. Uh, be a bit less than that for the route because I've been playing with the camera quite a bit. Well I hope you enjoyed coming out with me this morning even if all we did was uh, do a five mile run around uh, local fields. So if you did then please think about subscribing and uh, until I see you all again take care, look after yourselves, all the best and uh, Bye for now.